It's Charles Most Dangerous Crew, No Varsity Podcast. Your boy, C.O. McLean. It's your girl, Trap C. It's Sierra's Unscripted. Man, you know the fucking vibes. It's your boy, Muhammad Ali. What's cracking, y'all? Finally! Yes, he got yes, that sir. right. Intro together, because god point. damn it. I was on point. Yeah. Chill on me, yo. Shout my man, DJ Polo, <laughs> back there on the boards, holding us down. You know what I'm saying? But yo, man, we got a very special guest in the motherfucking building, all the way from ATL Thanks. to the CLT. You know what I'm saying? We ain't gonna, I ain't gonna introduce him. Bring him in the new Advisory Way Trap. Okay. Hey, how you doing? You feeling good today? Feeling great. All right, so listen, here at No Advisory, we ask artists or guests three simple questions three. to bring them in. You ready? Right, let's do it. Who you are? Who you are? Where you from? Where you from? And what, what the, the fuck, fuck you, you do? do? Okay. Who I am? Just a quiet kid from Mississippi, just having to be the best of what he do. Wanted to, you know, just dope at music. Uh, where I'm from? From I'm from Forest, Mississippi, Scott County, born and raised. Uh, that's my hometown. I'm, I'm always have love for them, and uh, you know, I make music. You know, I I, I inspire others. You know, I motivate. You know, I, I do what I can. Okay, right. um, we had a we had a debate. Well, was it last week about where you from and where you at and, and shit like that? So <laughs> that was not last week. That, that was, was like, like a month, ago. A month ago. That wasn't a month ago. <laughs> oh, yes, it was. Week. Bro. The nigga was throwing rice at bitches. Yeah, it was that week. It was that long ago. This is what I be talking about. That old nigga shit because you be forgetting shit. That was like a whole I do four take weeks B12 ago. Guys, got to my B twelve pills. Oh. But yo, you said from Mississippi, right? So <laughs> yes, where you currently residing? I'm in Atlanta right now. I'm based in Atlanta. How long you been in Atlanta? I've been in Atlanta for like almost three years. Since oh, okay, was, okay. So it doesn't apply years. to you. Okay, okay, okay. Cause we had a debate like where you from and where you at and shit yeah. like that. So okay. I mean, carry on. I mean, you could apply. You could, it don't apply. Years. So, would you say you're from Mississippi, right? You're not right. from ACL. No, no, I'm, from, I'm not from Atlanta. Okay, so if you was only if you was only living in Mississippi for like a year, but raised in Atlanta, you would say I, I was from Atlanta. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. you. That point. Thank you. Okay. Because I can be you. born in Mississippi, but if I was raised in Atlanta my whole life, then I'm from Atlanta. Yeah, because niggas from go. New York don't understand that apparently. What yeah. you mean? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Niggas from New York spent three weeks there and then yeah, yeah, New York. Yeah. And that's true. Yeah. That's true. Yeah. That's true though. That's true. They do be like that. They be like that. Doesn't apply to me though. Well, no, it don't don't apply to you. But we talking about the niggas that moved to Charlotte, that lived in New York for like four weeks. Now all of a sudden you're from New York. You was from Charlotte. You from Huntersville to be exact. So stop playing with me, like the birds. Please get out of here. Right, so let's get into J Lock, man. So let's. Where did the name derive from J Lock? I mean, it was two. It was two things. Uh, my biological name, uh, Jaden Lockett. You know, okay. I just wanted to shorten that up, uh, keep it short and sweet. And uh, the other one is uh, one of my favorite artists growing up listening to is J Cole. I wanted something okay. similar mm-hmm. to his Shout name, to so it was just those two reasons and everything. Okay. That's my son's name, or well, my middle son, Jaden. Shout out to Jaden. Yeah, shout out to Jaden. Yes, Jaden. Shout out to Jaden. Shout out to Jaden in the world. So I was reading your EPK. Shout out to you for having an EPK. Yes. 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 You don't know that's what that shit is. It's an electronic fact. press kit. That's yes. fact. If you're a real professional and you really take this yeah. shit serious, you should have one of those. Yeah. Thank shout you. Shout out to you first and foremost out, for having out, one. Out, um, and in that, I saw that you have been making music since 14. Most definitely. So do you remember like the sound that you was making at 14 versus the sound that you make now? Yeah, most definitely. I remember Every single day. I remember the first song I wrote. Oh wow! I remember. I, I and I got. I still got my notebooks because you know I write all my lyrics. So I, just, I got a like twenty notebooks at the crib since I was fourteen. I know exactly what year it was. I know exactly what mindset or headspace I was at that time. And yeah, I, I, I know the. I know the growth. I know the difference. Okay, gotcha. that's crazy. So well, like, what got your start into music? I know it was at fourteen, but when did you realize like, yo? I am doing this music shit because a lot of people do music and they trash yeah. as fuck. Um, yeah. So when did you realize like, yo, I'm doing music and niggas like, yo, you nasty and you like, alright, I'm gonna take this shit to another level. Right. I think I was around uh 15 or 16 when I wanted to like, yeah, okay, I'm I'm committed now. I'm finna take it serious. Like this, this what I want. Just seeing how the people react to it, how it made me feel. You know, just this it was my way to express myself, to, to put my my voice out there. You know, people wouldn't hear me outside of music. You know, so it's like this this was the one. And just to see how the people react, especially my hometown. And everything just to see how they react to my music it was just you know it was dope and you know i want to know about mississippi i know about atlanta I mean, yeah, I, got yeah. a, I got a question about yeah. that too actually yeah. you know like what's what's what's, what's we gonna get a lot of people from mississippi like, yeah. what's the mississippi yeah. music scene like? yeah music scene what's the food out there like what's the coach out there in mississippi and my double s i s s i p p i what the fuck did you know no that's not it that's not it no that ain't it he, 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 it's just the way he said it. It's just the, it's like, you got it though. Nah, it was nah, just nah, the way he nah, said that's it. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. The way he said it was just the way. Yeah, it was just the way. But you got it right though. You spelled it right. No. I got it right. You spelled it right. It's the way it was you just said the way he said it. Because as an avid watcher, yeah, cra- yeah. as an avid watcher of P Valley, you just pissed me off the way you said that shit. Hey, my double S I double S I B. No. 
Stop it. Okay, stop. She said a P value. Yeah. Yeah, shout but out not, to the pink. But to answer your question though, you know the the, the food out there is great. You know, you okay. the best one of the best soul food and everything. And that's yes. New Orleans because you know okay. it's right there. It's like next door neighbors, uh, yes. Louisiana, Mississippi. Shout out to New Orleans. Uh, as far as how uh, the see the music scene out there, to answer your question, it's a it's a lot of talent in Mississippi, but we don't have like big. You just laugh. No, I'm just playing. I'm just playing with you. <laughs> His old man loves Hey, we just, we just, uh, we just, uh, not, it's, it's a lot of talent, but we don't have like big marketing platforms like Atlanta or New York or LA or even Memphis, uh, getting a bigger scene out there and yeah. everything. We, we don't have that. And as soon as we have that, then you definitely see the talent out there. I feel like in recent years, though, there have been a lot of like emerging artists from Mississippi. Oh, yeah. That's right to arise. And it's kind of like now eyes is on like Mississippi, yeah. Alabama, definitely. areas like that. Yeah, but I you you right though. It's a lot of talent that's emerging. Like we got Akeem Ali, uh, Big Walk Dog. That's my uh, me. <laughs> better better say you. You know what I mean? Right. You. Like, no, no, but yeah. but, it's, but it's still not. It's not like Atlanta. It's still not like Memphis. It's still not like New York. It's it's. It, but we getting there though. It's 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 definitely showcasing and everything. All right. So my I got a question. Sorry. Yeah. I got a question. Uh, basically to piggyback off that. So how would you say like? The transition from Mississippi to Atlanta, how would you say that's influenced your style as an artist or, like, your creativity in regards to... If it influenced my uh, style. It made me more open-minded because, you know, I didn't, I didn't you know, I wasn't... Because I was listening to, like, conscious rap. You know, J. Cole, Kendrick, uh, you know, that type of rap. But I went, yeah. I went to, like, I ain't, I ain't pay no mind. Like, I want to listen to no thug, man, no future or... Woo, woo, but I, my producer Chevy put me on that, that Atlanta music and everything. So I'm like, let me be open minded. And I, it, every every since then, man, it, it influenced my sound a lot. As far as melodic sound, uh, melodic rap, uh, just the they cadence and everything, and they uh, the pockets they choose on. I don't know if that makes sense and everything, but yeah, it, it influenced you, so that Atlanta sense. scene. Atlanta music influenced my sound a lot. Mm -hmm. Now I know you know you said one of your influences is J Cole and um, like where. You know, we celebrating the 50 years of hip hop, and where like hip hop is transcending now, it's like really away from content, bars, lyrics, and shit like that to just niggas going in the booth and say ha ha ha, and this shit is a hit. You know what I'm saying? So being that those are one of your influences, like how do you feel? One, you feel you're gonna take that influence and bring your style into the game, and two, mm -hmm. how do you feel that influence is gonna carry the ne the next generation of um artists coming into the game? Uh, answer the first one. Hold on, what was the first question? How <laughs> I forgot myself. Shit. How do you feel like? <laughs> all I heard was like influence and influence. I was like, no, uh, yeah. With style. And yeah. Style. How do you feel yeah. like you being J. Yeah. Cole? You're flowing, your style's going to influence yeah. in this game now, yeah. and then yeah. how it's going to affect the other people that's coming into the game. How you want that to affect other people to come into the game? I want to. Uh, how I want to affect? People. I want to bring back like substance and music. You know, a, a lot of people don't have substance no more in music. No, yes. it, it only lasts for like two or three weeks. They like, dance with it, dance to your song on TikTok for like two weeks. Three days and it's, then it's over, then it's done. Yeah. I went to the next. I want I want songs that's gonna last long, uh, timeless. Some songs that can like you can play ten years from now, mm -hmm. and everything. So that's that's how I want to influence and everything. So and uh, I got a pretty interesting question. Not to cut you off, bro. Um, I want to know like what was the pro walk us through the process like from start to finish of how you ended up landing the feature with uh, finesse two times on your single money. Finesse Shout out to finesse two times. Yeah. Shout out to finesse two times. Uh, I, my manager, Big Block, uh, from Block Entertainment, and my uh, CEO, Block. Hubie, uh, uh, we were just at Pasture Studios. We was looking for a club banger, summer mm -hmm. anthem, man, every, everything. We needed something that was going to hit, you know, like, not even just for this summer, for every single summer and everything. So, we, you know, I, I made money. We were just in the studio recording money and everything. And Finesse just happened to walk by. He was like, that's that's the one. Mm. Oh, that's okay. the one I, that's the one I need to get on oh, right there. And awesome. he, he came Word. in, laid his verse down. His, his writing process is crazy, too. You know, he just got a whole bunch of just... Just rhymes and it's no, but I don't know. I don't know what it was—a suitcase or whatever it was. Suitcase of rhymes. I don't know what it was. Damn. God, yeah, damn. I don't know, but he just right. he pulled it out. You know, he went in there and laid it, and the rest was history. Okay, so, so since, since we talk about the studio, sorry, how are you approaching this creative process and like what is inspiring you? Yeah, I need like I can cuss on here. Yeah, no no advisor. Advisor. I need like what, what that say? No advisor. No advisor. Yeah, yeah. I need like five bad bitches in the studio. Oh my god! I need a stripper pole. Shit. We gonna have money. I'm gonna light candles and everything. Shout out to the candles. Uh, I respect. We gonna sage the room. Shout out to the candles. I respect you. Okay. You don't want no okay. bad energy in there. Okay. okay. <laughs> now nah, I'm just playing. But all, all I need is a producer, audio engineer, and my 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 pen and note. But that's all I need in the mm -hmm. studio. You know, my I, I'm very uh I like to structure my songs. I like to take my time with it. 
uh just like anything else in life uh yeah you know i just like the i like to be by myself most of the time and just that's that's how I, that's that's how i create my you know my music that's how i do it so what inspires you life itself you know whether it's Man. a uh beautiful woman uh sadness that. anger uh <laughs> I think life you itself, you know, it's 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 I'm, I'm easy to be inspired. Like even if I have a conversation with a a random person, where they homeless, white, black, and just any, I think life itself inspired me to, you awesome. know, keep so career. I have a question, kind of doubling back to the uh, finesse situation. So this is no advisory. So sometimes we do ask them questions, like we yeah. ask we ask them once. So I'm gonna get a little deep with that. So after the after the you know he walked by and all that stuff. So yeah, obviously yeah. it was kind of like. His idea, it wasn't like a thing where you reached out to him to get on the song. He kind of heard the song. And- nah, nah, nah. He heard the song. You know, it, it, it was a goat since he heard it and everything. You know. So did uh, he come afterwards and did he try to charge you for the feature or? Uh, I mean, nah. Yeah. I mean, I, uh, <laughs> yeah, you know, I told you, yeah. <laughs> no, 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 Stay tuned right, for it. Okay. okay, respect. You, right. you had to laugh respect. that off a little bit. Like, yeah. oh my God. Got out of that. He got out of that one real smooth. Yeah. Lock in out right now. Yeah. Mixtape. 11 yeah, songs dope. That's it. good PR so right there. Love good that. PR. Good. That is great good PR. PR. I, I would like, good whoever PR your PR training. is, is yeah. amazing. Training, man. Shut Media training. I love it. See, I like that. So I'm going to switch up the vibe a little bit. I love to ask this question to artists. I feel like it makes them think a little bit. If you had to set up a concert. Okay. Which you was the headliner. Right. Choose one person to open and one person to close, mm. and they could be underground, they could be signed, they yeah. could be a local artist that you know. That's a good question right there. So I, I'm basically in the middle, like this. got mm-hmm. one opening you, for you me. The act. You the act. You the act. I'm the act. act. Yeah. Yeah, the, right. One's closing. Mm. I ain't, I'm definitely ain't having Beyonce opening and closing. <laughs> from, I'm not know that for sure. <laughs> Uh, not 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 saying that, that's a compliment. That's a we compliment. Have a sure yeah, Beyonce, if she opened up she for you. Crazy. You know what I mean? Y'all see Swarm? Yeah. Y'all see Swarm? I mean, I, I, I definitely have uh one of my, I you know I like I like I like to show love to my city and everything. So I definitely have one of my my homeboys or one of my bros uh open up for me. Uh, Respect. shout out uh JB Quick, uh Rob okay. Creek. Okay. Uh. That's respect. I really rock with Akeem Ali, you know, him being from the Sip Yo, too and everything. Nice. He, he yeah. Real real dope lyricist and everything. As far as closing, who gonna close for me? Who who would I seen? Mm. Who I seen dope? You know, I ain't really been to that many concerts. I ain't never went to a concert. I went to the first one this year, I think it was not Rolling Loud. Was oh, it shit. Rolling Loud? Wow. Really that's like a good first, first one. Yeah. First yeah. Yeah. That's, a, yeah. that's a hell of an experience. How yeah, was that? Yeah. It, was, it was dope. It was dope. Wow. I'm, I'm, I'm probably have Travis Scott close it out. I think that'll be dope. Okay. 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 That's a good I think concert. that'll be dope. Uh, hopefully everybody, you know, still still alive at the end. Listen, yeah. man. At the, when it ends, and Travis though, they go, he gonna bring it back. Shout out to you, Travis. Yeah. Still yeah. rock. That's an interesting lineup. Wow, you know we, we gonna talk do? that into fruition. You know, yeah. you know we should yeah, do um, what we did last week with the questions. This or that? Would you rather? Oh, yeah, I got some. Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> I love Uh-oh. it. Uh-oh. Okay, Charlotte's most Uh-oh. dangerous. Uh-oh. I got some cool. hit it or quit it questions. Uh, okay, shout out to Jake. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so this game is called hit it or quit it. Okay. We're gonna ask you uncomfortable questions. That's I'm cool. With that you have to either answer which is hitting it or you quitting it, which is plead the fifth. Mm-hmm. All right. First question. Tread lightly, bro. Yeah. I'm, 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 What's the wildest I, DM you ever got from a female? Wildest DM? I'm mm-hmm. some some female. She texted me. I don't know who this was. I never met her a day in my life. I don't know. It was one of the tours. She said, "Can I give you hair from the from back?" I don't know. Can I give you hair from backwards? Or something like that. I was like, I ain't even reply. I don't even know what to say to that. Did you say you the gotta look at that motherfucker like? I don't even know. I don't. Yeah. That, you just look at it. Yeah. Like, hold on, what? What did yeah. you say? I mean, I don't know. I don't know how to reply to stuff like that. I don't you should have put a Kanye emoji. Just get. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> so that, yes or no? <laughs> what do you mean? I don't know what that means. <laughs> what the fuck you mean? So you know, you undecided if you gonna get the it or not? Like, does that mean? It's just like <laughs> it's just. <laughs> I'm screaming. Uh, but yeah, that that, that 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 was wild right there, you know. But shout out to her, you know, whoever she is. <laughs> shout out to her as a wife. Shout, shout out to you, Miss Ma'am. Shout, shout out to you. Man. Shout out to you, Miss Ma'am. <laughs> What's the first name only mm-hmm. of your first heartbreak? Ooh. 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 Shit. 
First heart. As a matter of fact, I was the one who said I love you first. Ooh, I know Little that song was playing in the background. Ago. I heard Ray J. Don't act like you don't know. Mm. We were sitting home. My first heartbreak. <laughs> said she got a nigga singing. <laughs> yeah. Sweet. And that right up. So uh, oh, it's deep as fuck. Hey, hey, that, that bro. Yeah. Yeah. It was like, hey. I'm going to sing a whole eight bars. Lock your mixtape out right now. <laughs> Make sure you go get it. <laughs> But now uh, like, I say, what's this? Oh, I give a high school one. You know, I don't really count. I don't really count. You know, okay. I'm saying, yeah. I'm gonna say, uh, I'm gonna say, Lanaya. Shout out, shout out, Lanaya. Shout out, Lanaya. Hey, shout out that's to Lanaya. That's the one that had you singing. Yeah, that's the one that had me singing. Oh, shout out okay. to Lanaya. Okay. Got this nigga. That's why you know it's crazy. He just said it don't mean nothing. But if you seen that Ray J shit, it means something because that nigga was in the rain. <laughs> if I had, yeah, I went. Yeah, come on, man. That was one weird. He was reenacting something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. what's her name? Shout out to Lanaya. Shout out to Lanaya. City girls of a thousand. High school heartbreak. You know. High school heartbreak. It happened. Yeah, damn. All right, I'm going to say this next question for last. Uh-oh. I'm going to ask an easy question next. Okay. Okay. Does size matter? I love that question. If a girl told you. I mean, I'm not a girl, so I would. looking for a certain size. Do you feel like you would be like. Yeah, I'm I'm good. Or I'd definitely be good. Okay. I'd definitely be good. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I don't know if size matters. I'm not a girl, so I don't know. If, right. I don't know if it matters or not. Cause I know so, girls that say like four, you, five okay. inches. Okay, Terrence, can you explain the question a little bit more? Yes. Thank you. Thank you. A short segment of cocktails with tea. So <laughs> listen, does size really matter? Let me tell you why it matters, and because I want you to understand it. Size mm -hmm. does matter because that motion in the ocean shit is bullshit. Okay. Yeah. There is no motion in the ocean if there is no boat in the ocean. <laughs> So, does right, size that's the first time I heard that. That's a that's a new one to me. Yo, you are. I'm explaining this because this is this was my topic the other week. Does size really matter? Because this Polo, stop looking at me like this. Because if there's no boat in the ocean, where is the motion at? Okay, you know what I'm saying. That's so, the one. I ain't never heard that. Go back I ain't never and heard answer that one. this question. Hey, you better bring the tape out again. Yes. Yeah. Answer this nah, question. Nah, I don't need to bring the tape out on this. Does size really matter? <laughs> I don't. I still don't like. I don't know if size. I don't know what it feels like for a girl. So I went. I went. So know. for you, like she said, for you, if if just say thumbs up or thumbs down for you. Mm. Thumbs up. You said thumbs All up. Right. Thumbs okay. up for sure. Okay. Better get two you thumbs know who up, we nigga. need to call? Lanae. We, hey, <laughs> call hey. Him. We gotta call her. Call her. We gotta call her. Call her. Let's right. get her on the line. Let's get her on the line, please. On the line. Phone a. What was that? Four okay. questions. You got huh? one more. Okay, this is yeah, my last question. First name only. Mm. Of the ugliest Please girl the you ever hit. The oh. ugliest girl I ever hit. Oh, shit. Oh. He, 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 he got two of them. Oh, no. You ain't pull out two of them. You ain't pull out the camera off. Two of them. Oh, no. You ain't pull out. No, no, no. Damn. First of all, <laughs> they're I was, stacked. I was looking this way, right? But then I hear niggas over here talking some moves. <laughs> all right, all right. All right. I ain't, I can't. I, uh, I, I'm, I'm, I'm going to quit it. Oh. Oh, mixtape out. Make sure y'all go check that out. Lock in out. <laughs> and you know crazy? Out. I thought he was going to hit quit on the other question. Not this one. Nah, nah. This, this one, y'all. That's why I said the yeah, because sis probably mm. watching. Not saying she was uh, ugly, nah, she but was you know, ugly. she, but she was all, ugly. Out of all the, yeah. Right, what's the first initial? Yeah, yeah. No, nah, I can't. I, I, I can't say. Oh, because she going to I'm going to quit it. She, she going to know. Sis probably watching. She going to know. Right, that phone going to so light up. Shit. My last question, which is kind of like a would you rather, since you are an artist, I'm going to ask you this question. It's the it's, it went viral, so since you are an artist, yeah, I don't know if it was five hundred thousand or five million, whatever, or mm -hmm. dinner with Jay Z. I'm, I'm taking the five hundred thousand. Smart, smart as fuck. Ho gonna look at me crazy at the other side of the dinner table. He gonna look at me crazy. See what yeah. you do is you take that bread, you flip that bread, and then end up on the table with Jay Z for free ninety nine. Yeah, exactly. That's true. Yeah. Okay, good answer. Smart. Good answer. Yeah, I, I, I'm like when niggas be like, I'm taking a dinner with Jay Z. I'm like, y'all niggas is crazy. Because I'm like, Jay Z won't even say that, and then no, he, he came out and say that, and you say Jay Z gonna look at you crazy. He gonna look at you crazy. Like nigga, you passed that five hundred thousand. Oh. Sit with me, nigga. Yeah. <laughs> the fuck? That should show how much respect I got for you. Then he gonna, then he gonna get a to go plate. Right. Right after you tell him, he got. I'm gonna get this to go. So let's talk about the tape for a minute. Man, who's yeah, yeah. on the tape? What features is on there? Like, what's the vibe that you want yeah. people to get out of when they sit down? And like, all right, is it no skips? Do you feel there's any skips? Mm. Like, break it down. Bring the whole tape down. Yeah, it's a lot of talent on the tape. We got uh, dope production from uh, Chevy, uh, AJ, what you cooking? Uh, shout out artists like Domani, uh, Jetty, uh, Die Hard Waves, uh, Finesse Two Times, and uh, you know, it's, it's it's a lot, a lot of talent on that on that project and everything. And as far as uh, what I want people to get 
from the project. You know, I'm, I'm speaking from the present, past, and future. You know, I, I got mm-hmm. songs that you know, that get you get to know me a little bit. You know, mm-hmm. where who I am and why I am the way I am and everything. And as far as uh present, you know, just the lifestyle I'm living, whether it's the club scenes, uh, jewelry, cars, money, girls, whatever, whatever the case is, and everything. The future, what's 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 yet to come, and everything. So that's that's what I want people to get out of there. That's facts, man. Um, so I like to ask this question. Who are your top three mm-hmm. artists of all time? Top all three. Time? All time. Here we go. Artists. That's a good question. Yeah. Here we go. <laughs> like I said before, J. Cole. Okay. I'm about to say you better have Cole Jay, in here. Got, gotta have Cole. <laughs> Kendrick Lamar. Okay. okay. Shout out to Kendrick. Cole. Solid. And I'm I'm put, this is not an order, by the way. This is not an order. Okay. I'm, I'm going to put Drake right there. Mm-hmm. Those are three that made me fall, mm. they made me fall in love with rap music. Okay, okay all time. Love we love that. All time. So let me ask my last question. I know you were talking about present, past, and future earlier. Yeah. What would past um, self say to present self now? I say it's okay to take L's. It's okay mm-hmm. to uh, uh, get kicked down, you know, and everything. As long as you get back up, as long as you keep, you know, keep trying and everything, it's okay to get out your comfort zone. You know, it's no growth being in your comfort zone. That's 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 how I see. Not even just music, just life. Period. You know, it's it's no growth being in your right. comfort zone. Right. So where's yeah. one of the um the best pieces of advice somebody has ever yeah. told you that stuck with you and then you had to use it mm. in your life today? I said it's, it's, it was short. It was short, sweet, and strong. You know, uh, pray. You know, my nana, nana told me to pray. My mom's told me to pray. Mm. You know, a lot of a lot of loved ones. They, they they just told me to pray. Whether you're happy, sad, mad, it just 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 you know, got got to have a relationship with God. And that's 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 what I do. That's fire. Love that. Amen. And on a Sunday. That's yeah. a good oh, it is Sunday, Sunday. That's a oh, good man, Sunday. Savannah. It is. It is. Uh, <laughs> was it in the Savannah? It was it in the Savannah? No. Oh, Never mind. Lock in now, right now. <laughs> Lock in now, right now. Oh, niggas. Mistake. I'm like, okay. what the fuck is that? <laughs> so my last question is a two-part question. <laughs> okay. Off your new project, yeah, yeah. what is your personal favorite song? Yeah. And the second part of that question is, what do you feel like is your fans' favorite song mm-hmm. off that? Ooh. Ooh, that's, that's a good Good question. My favorite off my favorite off of that project. It's like picking your favorite kid, but we all got a favorite. I think all y'all the parents got a favorite though. So you know we. Uh, yes, I, I was am, a favorite. I am the favorite actually. So. Oh, all yeah. y'all just happen to be the favorite. <laughs> we just all happen to be the favorite at the table. Yeah, yeah, I, I don't know. Somebody I'll line. call my mom and ask her. Yeah, we might have to do that. We're gonna do that on the next show. No, my favorite. One, I see my most personal one on there. Victoria Heights Drive. You know that 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 let the people get a you know a glimpse. At, you know my life and everything, and I say the people's favorites. Uh, I'm say Jet Speed for sure. Uh, mm. Jet right. Speed is a people's favorite. They they really rock with that song. Just not even just in the U S. I'm talking about the country and everything. Out of it, they they rocking with that for sure. Right. Yeah. My final question is: Where do? Because you know I hate that other cliches question when they say, "Where you see yourself in the next ten years?" Yeah. Fuck, that's a fucking decade. I don't know. But <laughs> next year, yeah. Where do you see yourself? Today, this time, next year. Because it's going to put pressure on you. Like, I did that interview. I said, next year, I'm going to be here. So, yeah. got to get it. Next year, this time, we're going to be. Well, next year, you see, y'all, y'all paying me next time to come up here and everything. <laughs> <laughs> nah. Well, now, next year, you know, I'm uh That's fast. That's fast. That's fast. <laughs> that's fast. That's a goal. Yeah. <laughs> next year, I'm definitely, definitely, you, you're going to be seeing me a, a lot, lot more. You, I'm definitely be... I'm be everywhere. Like we, we we working, man. That's that's one thing I can say for sure. Stone and Road music, we working it. You're gonna be seeing me a lot. A lot, a lot. So yeah. That's yeah, facts. That's fire. What's your final word? Where they can find the mixtape, where they can find you yeah. out on all streaming platforms. Let these motherfuckers know. Yeah, yeah. My main source, my Instagram, J dot lock official, J dot lock official. I'm on every single platform. Make sure you check out my lock in mixtape on every single platform. And stay tuned for my project coming out next year. Dirty Side Playboy R and B project is gonna be dope. The ladies gonna love it and everything. And yeah, yeah. And I okay. got a performance tonight at the tour. I'm on tour with Jack Reese and everything. I got a performance in Charlotte, so make sure you yes, pop sir. out yes. and everything. It's gonna be dope and everything. Yeah, yeah. Yay. Yes, sir. Now you got the song still queued in. Money. No. You got it? Oh, no, no, I don't got it. I got it on my phone. Yeah. I got okay, it. we're gonna queue it in. I want okay. you to introduce the song because we're gonna ride out. You want you to bring the single in. Yeah, yeah. We're going to ride it to the song. We're going to put, can they see that? Y'all can see that, right? We're going to get a thing on there. We're this is it. dope. I like this. Who came up with this? Oh, this Eastside, 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 Eastside. Okay. Shout out your peoples who are in the shout building. Out Eastside. Hey, everybody, they got peoples in the building. Well, nah, they don't get no shout out. They don't get no shout out. I'm the star. Oh, they don't get no shout out. Yes, David Ruffin. Say you Otis. I'm the star guy. I'm the star guy, David. Nobody came to see you. Ain't nobody came to see you, Otis. 
Damn. Nobody came to see you. Hit the button on. Damn. Damn. Which one is it? Really now? But yeah, you what I want to start right now? Yeah, who there? Who there? Shout him out. Yeah, shout out. I want to shout out my producer, Chevy, and everything. He did a lot and putting that project together and everything. Right. Shout out my boy Al, you know, he's been working and everything on the team too. Eastside D, right. legendary right. from the ATL. Shout out Ice, you know what I mean? One of the best securities out right now. He gonna, hey, don't even touch me. Don't touch me. He might run over here. He <laughs> might run up. Oh, hey, Ice, come get him. <laughs> ice, come get him, Ice. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out my boy Guapo. I've been rocking with him since high school. Yeah, you right, you right, you right. You right. Shout okay. out Guapo, you know, been rocking with me since high school, supporting my music and everything. Right. Shout out Charles. And everything, you know, yeah, yeah. I do. How we doing it? Yeah, yeah. Nice. Well, I mean, shout out yeah. Spike on the cameraman shout and everything. Spike and yeah. camera. I can't wait to I make you because I'm gonna shout y'all out too. Because I'm gonna shout y'all out. Shut up, CEO, best security. <laughs> <laughs> Secure what? Right, right, right. Shit, hold on. <laughs> He okay, the hype man. Yeah. okay, right. But Joe, man, you know what it is, man. It's my man, Jay Lock. It's your boy, oh, yeah. Seal McClain. <laughs> it's your girl, Trap C. It's Sarah's Unscripted. It's your boy, Muhammad Ali, man. Peace. And oh, wait. Bring in, huh? Like and subscribe. Please. Yes. Yes. Like and subscribe. I forgot. Like and subscribe. And I'm we're going to bring in a single. Bring in that single right quick. Actually, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, wait. Let him bring in it right. Let me Go bring ahead. it in. Let me bring it in. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. This is Money Feature for Ness two times. If you ain't got none, go get you some. Yeah, yeah. So I give a money talk. I hop in the bed like Tony Stark. The table you know me a sunny walk. I'm big, but they try to look the dog. So they hop in the cage, it's a rock roll. A little ashes and a lot of talk. Man, you niggas a whole bunch of modern moss. Melissa, man, I fell in love with this shit. Keep it a band, can't love me a bitch. Lives if you heard him cuffing the trick. Fuck shot, you wanna cut on shit. Hold so you know I'm ducking the kiss. Still, she can come and suck on this shit. Told her, please make it fast and quick. She said, why you in a rush and shit? You know what it is. Money, 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 money. Money, woo, money, 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 woo. Get to the, get to the bag of shit. Get to the bag of shit. Get to the, get to the bag of shit. Get to the, get to the bag. Need that money, 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 woo. Money, 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 woo. Get to the, get to the bag of shit. Get to the bag of shit. Get to the, get to the bag of shit. Get to the, get to the bag, nigga. Now I ain't gon' say I'm the goat, but I'm dope. Came in on a boat. Had meal on my neck, I'ma soak. Anti-social made a million and spoke. I ain't talking unless this about some money. Fuck beef, cause these niggas baloney. I pray to God, I don't see the up. Cause Lord knows, I'ma shoot the whole hundred. Check that reaction, subliminal captions is crazy, cause now I'm a target. A year ago, they hung me up like a hanger and left me inside of the closet. I teach the gist how to come up from nothing. They don't wanna listen, they clutching and busting. These niggas ain't coming up in my discussion. For every action, it's a repercussion. I'ma kill Money, 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 woo, money. Get to the bag of shit. Get to the bag of shit. Get to the get to the bag of shit. Get to the get to the bag. Need that money. 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 Woo. Money. 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 Woo. Get to the get to the bag of shit. Get to the bag of shit. Get to the get to the bag of shit. Get to the get to the bag. Nigga, don't miss. I've been really on the scene. Really, I'm a bag fiend. Got the suits on mine. Everything green. Cause long as hell come with cheese. I came from nothing, man. I had to leave. Posse was drunk and stand on his feet. Man, it was tough, couldn't get sleep. My first class getting Z's, man. Goddamn. Man, Catch a nigga from the sip side, not a boy sliding like them. Uh, man, I'm hotter than a fish fry, yeah, the boy sliding like them. Uh, so I'm not going bad, laid on the mat, bigger low bound. Uh, only thing on my mind, really, all the time is that money, 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 woo, money, 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 woo. Get to the, get to the bag of shit. Get to the bag of shit. Get to the bag of shit. Get to the get to the bag. Need that money, 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 woo, money, 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 woo. Get to the get to the bag of shit. Get to the bag of shit. Get to the get to the.